Each of the last 30 years, I've spent roughly two to three months abroad. I've left my children, I've left my husband, I've left my family. I've acted with many, many, many other countries to create a system which we thought was going to prevent climate change from becoming uh, uh, climate chaos, which is what we find ourselves in. None of these high ambition supposed countries with uh, major economies, major resources, have done enough to prevent climate change. We can no longer remain silent in the face of this reality. Therefore, as lawyers, we declare a climate and ecological emergency, and we name the failing of our profession and the legal system as a key contributor to this crisis. We wish to re-establish lawyers as powerful storytellers with the intelligence, imagination, influence and courage to shape the world around us according to our principles of conscience. Our peaceful, non-violent civil disobedience is inspired by Mahatma Gandhi, who was disbarred from Inner Temple in 1922 for peaceful civil disobedience that demanded freedom, justice and rights for his people. Civil disobedience has a noble history and in the law courts the idea is that you should treat people lightly because they're doing this out of moral duty. It's actually time for some members of the judiciary to be brave, to actually recognise them as conscientious protectors.